Hello and welcome to email skills video tutorial. In this video tutorial, we will see how to change the root password of uh, MySQL 5.6 on Windows Server. So due to some reasons, I have uh, forgotten uh, root password and I'm not able to log in. Just, just to simulate this, just I'm saying MySQL hyphen U uh, root uh, hyphen P password and password. Uh, I thought it is MySQL 1234, but it is not working due to some reasons so what i'm supposed to do is i'm supposed to reset the mysql uh, uh, root uh, uh, password so what i'm going to do is uh, it, this requires a downtime so the first step which i have to do is to stop the mysql d services in uh, windows so i will just go to services.msc i have to locate the service which is corresponding to the instance which i'm going to shut down so this is the instance so i have just to uh, do is just to stop this service this requires a downtime so please make sure that you have the downtime to perform this activity then what we are going to do is we are going to create a password reset dot txt and we are going to add these three lines uh, the, these three commands which will be used as use mysql update mysql dot user set password and the password which we are going to use at mysql one two three four and uh, user will be the root so let's create uh, the uh, uh, file with, with, with this name and uh, we will uh, save all this and it has to be saved in this particular file you can keep any name uh, as you wish I'll just say password reset dot txt and I have copied these lines. Now I have to execute this command. First, I need to log into the uh, command and I'll uh, navigate till uh, uh, MySQL Server 5.6 bin, the executable location. I think I'm already uh, till there. It is C program files MySQL, MySQL Server 5.6 uh, bin. and uh, then i have to execute this command which says mysql d hyphen hyphen default hyphen file and uh, then i'll give uh, the location of uh, my dot ini file and uh, then the uh, the the file wherein three lines are inserted so i'll just give the complete location yes and uh, from uh, command prompt I just have to execute this so it has to take as an input hyphen hyphen in it hyphen file so the, the the new file location where the three lines are inserted so we'll wait for a couple of uh, minutes or maybe uh, 30 seconds or so where wherein this all command will get executed and this is not going to come out so just to overcome the situation this will keep on running for forever so uh, we have we are supposed to kill this particular session using uh, uh, task manager so i'll go to task manager and i'll have to kill it So this is the one. My SQL. Where's the My SQL? This is mysql d.exe let's uh, kill this and task it has came out we are expecting that it has uh, completed the execution and then the next step is we'll start the mysql service and we will try to log in with the new password which we have put into the uh, the new file the initialization file and this is uh, the mysql uh, service has been started now Let's log in with the new uh, password. MySQL hyphen u hyphen uh, root hyphen p password and the password which we have put into that uh, 
uh, file is mysql1234 let's log in with this if this is done that means it is successful show databases it's very simple straight away uh, just you need to make sure that you have the downtime to stop the instance and then you need to put the three lines which is going to update uh, uh, the mysql database if you see this is your uh, mysql database which is inside your instance and it will update forcefully that particular uh, uh, a database and the user mysql.user and it will set the password desired password whatever you wanted to use and then you have to execute the mysql d then the default ini file location you have to give and the new initialization file which will forcefully reset the password then you start the instance and uh, try to log in with the new password that's it i hope this is going to help and uh, thanks for watching